Hey everybody, Adam from Atlas Gunworks, talking about mag springs for the STI mags and the Gen 2 followers. All right, getting into this, the mags um, for the lockback on the 2011s, you've seen us talk about them a lot, but they're getting a lot better and things are always happening. And here at Atlas Gunworks, we've just come out with a, we had a plus 10% spring. This is our new plus 15. So factory STI, they actually just upped theirs. Um, they got a little more spring power in theirs, but we went even bigger and better with ours. So you get some super positive lockback. So for instance, 126 mag and a Helios, Gen 2 follower, nice positive full engagement there. And um, you can get that really consistently across a batch of mags. Um, sometimes a little tuning required, but nothing too terribly crazy. So here's some of the updates that uh, have gone on with the STI followers. The original follower looked a lot like this follower. We'll go up here in the light but didn't have these little recessed pockets. And then they came out with this follower for a short period of time. So these are Gen 2 followers. So if you see these, it's definitely a Gen 2. And then if you see one that looks like this, you gotta look and see if these little pockets are recessed. And then you gotta measure this part. So where the Gen 2s are different than the Gen 1s, and this is all for a Gen 2 mag, not the old, old ones. For the, That's a whole different animal. But you go to measure here and you're going to get somewhere between, you know, higher than 570. If you measure up a little bit, you're going to get in the 580s. So that's how you're going to tell if it's a wide one or not. And what this does, yeah, 580, 590, somewhere in there in the wide. <clears throat> um, so if you've got one that looks like this and it doesn't have these two little pockets, measure here, you probably got an original one. They ran those for about a year and a half, I think, two years maybe. Um, probably closer to a year and a half. But the <clears throat> what we're seeing with the factory mags is that they take a pretty good set and then they don't have quite the pop. So we had a plus 10% spring made. It was definitely an improvement. We liked it, wanted a little more horsepower and now the plus 15 springs here. And it's working really, really well. It's super consistent. So um, that's how you identify your Gen 2 follower. And the nice thing about the Gen 2s is because they're wider, they don't tilt in the mags. And then the extra spring combined with that, and you know, we can across five or six mags as a set get nice positive lock back. So, there's our um, plus 15 spring. You'll see that on the website soon, and um, hopefully, I see you guys on the range soon. Sure.